What's up, Cherry Blossom family? Welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, hi, my name is Jessie, also known as Miss Cherry. And if you're a returning subscriber, what's up, guys? So glad that you are back today for another super fun video. This is gonna be a pretty epic video. We are doing a humongous giveaway and actually it's two giveaways in one video <laughs> which is kind of a lot but you guys deserve a lot so I wanted to make a very epic giveaway for you guys because we are celebrating 15,000 subscribers for the channel and actually now it's 16 <laughs> which is wild so I want to say thank you guys so much um, for being here spending time with me, coming back video after video after video, you guys are amazing. And it's really difficult to be able to thank each and every one of you. And I think the best way to do that is through a giveaway. So that's what we are doing today. I'm so glad and thankful for you to be part of our Cherry Blossom family community and our community here on Disney YouTube. And I think that both of these giveaways are gonna be really fun. But before I get into these giveaways, there's actually two more giveaways coming after this giveaway. <laughs> so my friends over at Magic at Your Door and Bibbidi Bobbidi Boxes are also sponsoring a giveaway coming up within the next few weeks. So be on the watch for those videos as well. You are definitely gonna want to subscribe and also go follow me over on Instagram because there's gonna be bonus entries on both of those platforms. So be sure to do that. We are going to get in to the first giveaway, something that I want to say as a disclaimer before we begin is that you are probably going to see some things that look a little bit familiar to you because some of the things that I'm giving away are things that I've received in duplicate in subscription boxes. I get a ton of Disney subscription boxes and we do Mystery Box May every May, um, which is basically a new uh, Disney subscription box every week for the month of May including my regular box subscriptions. And I unfortunately sometimes receive some duplicates. So instead of taking these duplicates and selling them or doing something like that, I want to give them to you because I think that you deserve them so much more than a stranger that I don't know. I would rather them go to someone who loves Disney as much as I do and who watches the channel and appreciates this type of content and these types of products. So if I did receive it in duplicate from a box, I will let you know during this video, but let's go ahead and get started. <laughs> Giveaway mystery box, Miss Cherry mystery box. Ooh, is that what we're gonna call this? Miss Cherry mystery box number one <laughs> is, we've got a little theme going on. We've got a little kitchen theme going on. And we are gonna start with this spoon rest. And actually, this spoon rest is a duplicate that I received from a subscription box. It is a Mickey glove hand. And I actually have this in my kitchen right now, but I did receive it in a uh, Mickey's mystery box, which unfortunately they're no longer a company anymore, but I thought this was very cute and a very subtle Disney uh, item that you can have for your kitchen. The next item in Miss Cherry's mystery box, <laughs> number one. <laughs> Don't worry, I won't say that during every, uh, every item or I hope that I won't. We have this super cool bottle opener slash pizza cutter that is a pizza planet pizza cutter isn't this so cute and this is actually an item that i received through uh, magic moon club they are one of my most favorite disney small shops small t-shirt shops they're from the uk i'm gonna link them down below because if you haven't checked them out they are amazing. They make the most silly, fun t-shirts. And actually, I had the opportunity to do a collaboration with them last year where we made a daddy t-shirt for King Triton. So I'll link their information down below. But anyway, they sent this to me and I actually have, I think, four of them. <laughs> so I thought that you guys might like to have one of them. So we have a really fun pizza cutter. That would be super fun for a Toy Story themed night. Now this item I purchased because it was just so cool. It's from this company called Spoonify. And for those of you that know me very well know I am a huge Little Mermaid fan and I know a lot of you are as well. And we got these really, really cool laser engraved spoons. Now they are connected with a ribbon and I'm gonna try to keep the ribbon intact. 
But first we have a scuttle and then it's got a little uh, seahorse at the bottom. Then we have a silhouette of Ariel and it says the little mermaid in the font that is for the film. And then we've got flounder and a bunch of starfish. We have got Ariel and flounder and lots of fun seashells and then Last, but certainly not least, <laughs> we've got Daddy though! For anyone who is new to the channel, we like to call King Triton Daddy. Uh, and then at the very bottom, we have Ariel looking so um, poised there on her rock, thinking, I'm sure, about Prince Eric and not about her father. So these are really super cute. My friend Jenny over on Instagram sent these to me and said, oh my gosh, have you seen these? And I said, no, and I'm buying those and another set for myself. <laughs> so we're spoon slash spatula twins if you happen to receive this item. Oh, and also this giveaway is international. I totally forgot to say that in the beginning of the video. I'm so sorry, but this, this uh, giveaway is open globally. Next, we have an item that I did receive in duplicate, but it's a super awesome item. This is a Mickey Mouse towel set, and it's got Mickey, uh, his little ears. This is embroidered. I thought it was so pretty. And this is actually one that I bought for myself when I was in the parks, and then I happened to receive it in a mystery box. And then here on the back, there are a bunch of park emblems that I thought were so cool. We've got the castle. We have Mickey Mouse, his glove, a teacup, the little clock from Small World, Sorcerer Mickey hat, and yeah, so we've got, this is kind of a scrubby towel, and then this is a soft absorbent towel. And these usually retail for about $20. Next, this was actually given to me by a sponsorship. Uh, Big Potato Games is a great uh, colleague of mine. We've worked together a couple of times and they sent me some extra Disney Color Brain games, which if you haven't played this game, it's a super fun, family-friendly game that actually is really challenging. I'm a hardcore Disney fan and I still struggle sometimes with some of these questions, but basically it tells you like, or it asks you the question, what is the jewel in Jasmine's headband? And then you use your color cards to say what color that jewel is in her headband and you battle against each other. It's actually super duper fun. And so this is gonna be included with the first prize pack. Thank you to Big Potato Games for sending me some extra of these to give to you guys. Next we have, oh, I love this item so much. And we are, whew, we are bracelet twins. And I wear this from August through November, I would say. Obviously, this is a duplicate item, but it is literally everything. We have the queen villain herself, Ursula, and an Alex and Ani bracelet. And this says diabolically devious, and it does have a little spider web behind her. It was meant to be worn, I think, for Halloween, hence like the Halloween elements of the spider web behind her. And it does have King Triton's trident underneath her there if you can see there we go I think it's focusing a little bit better but this is so cool it's like almost a gunmetal but it is a silver bracelet this bracelet retails for $45 and it is I love it so much <laughs> so we'll be bracelet twins <laughs> And next, this I purchased from a small shop because I just thought it was so cool. This is from Oh Hey Studios on Etsy. Let me take it out of the package so I can show you a little bit closer. And all of these small shops, if, if I, there's more small shops coming up, but all the small shops will be linked down below so you can find these items just in case you are interested in taking a peek. But this item is from Oh Hey Studios and it happens to be a Rex from Toy Story burn book from Mean Girls slash Ariana Grande thank you next reference. That's a lot of referencing. <laughs> we got a, we got a triple reference. Um, but I am a huge fan of Ariana Grande, big fan of Toy Story, and obviously a big fan of Mean Girls. So this was absolutely the most perfect small shop pin that I could think of for a fantasy pin and I'm so excited to have one with you. I bought one for myself and also I bought one to give to you guys because mostly things that I enjoy you guys are enjoying so I am hoping that you love this crossover but it says thank you Rex. <laughs> 
so silly. And then this, I actually got this as a gift from my friend Holly. Holly sent me this gift a few months back and then I received it in a Magic at Your Door box, but I know that all of you love the Disney Men as much as I do. And we have a Disney Prince mug. Now, when I say this mug is big, it's literally as big as my head is. It's huge. Mungus. <laughs> but what I love about this, it has all of the Disney princes. This was from their Oh My Disney collection that came out recently. It's got Li Shang, Naveen, Prince Philip, Her Hercules. How many? I can we get more Hercules, please? Hercules, it's got, oh. Da -da 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 you know that song? Anyway. Um, Philip, it's got, it's got, um, What's that guy's name? Oh, Ferdinand, Prince Ferdinand. It's a terrible name. Aladdin, no offense if your name is Ferdinand. I think you have a beautiful name. I just didn't love it for the prince. Um, Kronk, a Kronk is in there. No one understands why Kronk is in there. I don't understand why Kronk is in there. And then we have Prince Adam, which is, I know, a very controversial thing to call this prince. I call him Prince Adam. It's kind of like a faux pas in the Disney community, but I, I call him Adam. He's apparently a nameless prince, so we can... Can we rename him to the prince who must not be named, like Voldemort? <laughs> he was better as the Beast. They should have put the Beast in there. Um, but this mug is incredible. It is massive. It retailed originally for $14.95. I'm pretty sure you can fit a good 20 to 24 ounces of coffee in here, so come prepared. You're going to take a duty real quick. <laughs> anyway, the last but certainly not least item. I love it so much. I hope that you do too. We are going to be backpack twins. I purchased this for you guys because I think this design is just so cool. It is a lounge fly mini backpack that happens to be the Disney World version of the Icons uh, backpack. And I love this dark teal color. I think it's super classic. It goes with everything. And so I'm gonna do a close up and show you what this looks like so you can take a better look at this. So here is the front pocket. It does have gold hardware, which is really fun, but it's filled with all different park emblems and also characters from the parks. So you'll see the little dog from Pirates, Goofy, Mickey Balloons, the small world clock, the bottom half of Big Al, Big Al's top half is right here. <laughs> Don't worry, he didn't get cut in half too badly. We've got the pirate symbol, Pluto, the ride vehicle from Peter Pan, Dumbo. We got a turkey leg randomly in there, but what I love about this, I picked out this placement for you guys and I thought you'd really like it. In the center of this bag is Cinderella Castle right in the very center. Isn't that beautiful? With the Peter Pan ride vehicle right beside it, the teacups, Space Mountain, really all of the uh, quintessential park icons are right around the Cinderella Castle. And I just thought that placement was so cool. And then let's take a peek at the inside of the bag. We all know that Loungefly has amazing um, interior. This one is kind of plain because the outside is so colorful, but we just have a teal and white striped, very much looking like a Dapper Dan costume. So that concludes what is in Miss Cherry's mystery box number one. And now we're going to go to Miss Cherry's mystery box number two. I feel like we need to make an acronym for that. It's so long. <laughs> Anywho, on to the second mystery box that you can win, although it's not really a mystery anymore. But we do have a copy of the Disney Color Brain game. Again, thanks to Big Potato Games for sending this my direction. We have a really fun item that is actually from a box lunch exclusive Earth Day item. It is the Funko Pop of Miko and Flit. And I don't wanna take it out of the box since it's technically not my pop. So I'm just gonna do my best to show it to you within the box, although sometimes that's a little bit hard. So we've got Miko in there holding a berry and then Flit in there as well with a little berry on his nose. Is Flit a boy? Flit is, a, is Flit a boy? It doesn't matter what gender Flit is. Okay. Anyway. <laughs> And then on the front of the box, it says a box lunch exclusive from Earth Day. They did use um, recycled material to create this box, which I thought was really cool. It's Pocahontas. And so here is the side. This is so adorable. Miko and Flit. 
They only had one from this collection, so there wasn't anything to add. Usually on the back of pop figures, you'll see several different uh, designs. And then is Miko with Flit. And this was so cute. I saw this in box lunch and I was like, oh my gosh, I have to buy this. I have to give this away because I thought there are so many people that watch the channel that love Pocahontas and especially love Miko because anytime there's Miko items, so many people are like, I love Miko. And I totally understand that sentiment and I agree with you. So moving on to the next item. Now this item I did receive in duplicate from two of my favorite <laughs> box companies, which is Magic at Your Door and Bippity Boxes. This is a Baymax mini hug figurine and I'm taking it out of the box because it is very hard to see inside of this box, but I will wrap it back up before I send it out to you. It is Baymax in the hairy baby scene where he is petting Mochi the cat. And this is just too cute. I love this so much. This is definitely my favorite from my Baymax collection of figurines that I own. I think it is so adorable and I am so here for it. And so I hope that you guys love this little Baymax figurine as much as I do. He is just everything. And I have a cat named Telly who is a calico and she very much looks like Mochi. So I think that's why I connect with that scene so much. You'll find me at two in the morning petting my cat like that and saying, hairy baby. The next item I'm giving away is from a small shop that was introduced to me by my friend, Oh Hello Robin. And she sent me a pin from this shop and I fell in love with this shop. And I know a lot of you, again, are Little Mermaid fans. So I thought that I should get you guys one of these because I thought you would really like it. It's from Alicia's Wonderland shop and it is the Disney D. And it's like the Disney D is Disney bounding as Ursula. So you'll see like King Triton's crown in there, Flotsam and Jetsam, Daddy's Trident. There's also the contract that Ariel signs and there are glitter elements within this pin. I'm a huge fan of Disney fantasy pins and I know some of you are as well. And this was just too cool to pass up. So again, I'll leave Alicia's Wonderland information down in the description box down below if you wanna visit her shop. I would highly suggest it. I have several pins now from her shop and they are, a lot of them are Disney D's and they are everything. <laughs> they also have a kiss the girl scene one too that I really, really love. But I thought since we're getting close to spooky season that having a villains one might be a better option. So next we have a really fun item from Primark. And I thought that since hopefully we'll be able to go traveling very soon that one of you could use this this is a luggage tag that's of the man himself, Mickey Mouse, and it is a rubberized luggage tag. I think it is so adorable. And I'm not gonna take it out of the box. The back of it, I have one on my carry-on right now. The back of it just has an address on the back. And um, it's like name, address, and phone number, I think it is. So pretty simple, pretty cute. Fingers crossed we can go traveling very soon. Next, we have this really super cool item. This is the poster art of the Disney Parks, 36 postcards inspired by creativity. So I purchased this item because a lot of our community, our Terry Blossom family community, is very creative and very artsy and love crafts and things of that nature. And this is basically a, an adult coloring book of all sorts of different emblems from the park. Like you're gonna be blown away by this. Let me, let me do a close up so you can see. So here is what the inside looks like. And then we have got tons and tons of pages inside. And yes, these are all postcards. So once you get them all colored, oh, Haunted Mansion then you can send them off to your loved ones. I thought this was so fun, especially since we're kind of social distancing right now. This would be something fun to send to maybe another Disney fan in your life, like color it for them and send it to them of their favorite attraction or character from the parks. I thought it was really cool that a lot of them have the original attraction poster artwork. The next item I'm going to show you is another fantasy pin from a small shop. And I ordered two of these because I wanted to give one of them away because I thought it was so cool. This is actually from Mad Unicorn Handmade on um, Etsy, and I will again link them down below. But this is a treasure chest, 
And if you haven't seen that haul, I'll definitely link it above and down below for you to watch. But this is a treasure chest full of Atlantica, the castle, which I always feel that uh, King Triton's castle is not well represented in merchandise. So I love that about it. It's got the silhouette of Ariel and also a dingle hopper in there too. It's such a beautiful, well-made pin. I'm a big fan of this company. They make a lot of very cute pins. So I'll be sending this along in the Miss Cherry's mystery box number two. We're getting to the big items for this giveaway. And I am so, so excited about these next three items. I had a lot of requests from you guys when I had you put in some suggestions for what you wanted to see in the giveaway. A lot of you said small shop items. Well, I'm bringing you two major small shop items coming up and then the big item was another thing that you guys requested and this is a beautiful necklace from Lillian and Co. So Lillian and Co is a small shop from Disney and this is uh, Cinderella inspired and I thought it was a great message and this is so pretty. So this is a necklace. So usually you see Lillian and Co bracelets this is a necklace that is just a straight pendant. On one side it says, have courage. And on the other side it says, be kind. And this is in silver. Every Lillian & Co item has a little message about what it means and why they created it. And this one says, have courage and be kind. No matter what, have the courage to do the things that catapult you from your comfort zone. Have the courage to show up for yourself, believe in yourself and trust yourself no matter what people say or what happens. Then be kind to everyone you meet because they're trying to do the same thing. This is the secret that will see you through all the things life will offer. That was a lovely message and a lovely company, Lillian and Co. Again, I will link them down below. I purchased this, I'm not sponsored by them or anything like that. The next item is so, so exciting. So a few pixie dusted parcels, which is my, my version of Magic Mail, ago. I received this. This is my tumbler. That is a Disney princess tumbler. You're not gonna get this item, just so you know. This tumbler is incredible. It's made by a sweet woman named Ashley. She is so kind and wonderful, and she sent this to me as a gift. And I'm telling you, I have literally had it with me every single day since she sent it to me. It's one of those cups that like, when you put ice in it, the ice is still there the next day. It is so amazing and so high quality and so beautiful. And I reached out to her and I was like, hey, um, out of curiosity, do you have any extra um, tumblers hanging around? Because I would love to do a giveaway because so many of you, I'm talking like at least 50 comments commented about how much they love that tumbler. And I listened to that because <laughs> I love it too and I totally understand. And so she made us a custom tumbler that I can give away in this video and I am so jazzed about it. So where are all my Dole Whip fans at? <laughs> How stunning is this? And can we talk about a Mickey Cherry? This Cherry Mick. Ashley, stop. <laughs> Amazing. So this is a Dole Whip. We've got Hawaiian flowers. We've got limes, strawberries, oranges, hibiscus, pineapple. This is beautiful. I'd like to do a little close up of the <laughs> Dole Whip. Sorry, it's so bright in here. Let me there we go, a little bit less glare. But there is this really soft iridescent color of glitter over the top of it that is just so pretty. This is so festive. This is gonna be such a fun item for someone to get and I hope that you guys love it as much as I do. I love. Now, Ashley not only sent that, she also sent this stunning red Mickey Mouse straw topper. So this goes on your straw and kind of hangs out like on the top of your cup. So your cup can have Mickey ears. Ashley, stop. So just so you know, this is from Pretty Neat Creations. 
And so I'm gonna link her Etsy shop as well as her Instagram down below. Her company comes so, so highly recommended. It is seriously my favorite small shop right now. I have ordered three other tumblers for myself from her because I need some variety in my life. And so I ordered, she's got, guys, she has a Lisa Frank. I repeat, this is not, this is not a drill. <laughs> She's got Lisa Frank Christmas, Halloween. She's got um, a whole Tim Burton one. She's got Disney. She's got Disney Christmas. Oh, there's a, a Disney Halloween treats one. Oh my gosh, guys, go check her out. I cannot rave about her enough. This also comes with a straw that is completely sealed. I just didn't feel like I needed to model the straw for you. And now the final item. So, I purchased this because, um, if you're not following me on Instagram, again, be sure to go follow me because I posted this on Instagram and I had so many people contact me about this bag and saying how much they loved it that I decided to buy one for the giveaway because I thought you guys would love to have it too. And it happens to be the Peter Pan Mermaid Lagoon backpack. <sighs> this backpack. I have been wearing mine out like every I received so many compliments about it too it's the perfect size it's a little bit different than your traditional lounge fly backpack but it's got the mermaid lagoon scene and I'm gonna leave Peter in his little sealed container I don't want to take him off because I do want him there for packaging but Peter is a dangle and then there's all the mermaids from the mermaid lagoon it's got silver hardware on the back it says just imagine real mermaids and it is actually embroidered on there. It is a Disney lounge fly. It does not have side pockets, so a lot of mini backpacks generally have side pockets. On the inside is a really pretty, a really pretty, pretty teal color that has seaweed and also some starfish in it. I love this backpack. It is a faux leather backpack. One of my most favorite items, and I hope that you guys love it too. This portion concludes the Miss, Miss Cherry's Mystery Box number two. If you would like to enter to be a part of this giveaway, you have to be 18 years or older. Also, you must be subscribed to my channel, like this video, and tell me down below if you could create a lounge fly backpack or a piece of Disney merch, what you would create. It can't be out there already. I want us to be creative in the comments and I wanna go on a merchandise journey with you. <laughs> And also be sure to head over to my Instagram account at Miss Jessie Cherry. We are going to have a bonus entry over there that is going to be put up by the time that this video goes live. So be sure to go and check that out and enter to win over on my Instagram page. Now you have until August 23rd to enter. So be sure to check back to my channel after that and I will be announcing the winner through the community tab. Again, I want to thank you guys from the bottom of my heart for being a part of my channel, for being here, for being amazing and part of this awesome Disney community here on YouTube. I can't thank you enough. I hope that this giveaway uh, was just a little token of my appreciation to you. Again, be sure to check out my Instagram for that bonus entry. Details for that are going to be in the caption and all of the ways to enter are going to be listed in that description box below. Good luck to everyone who enters. Thank you so much from the bottom of my heart and I will see you guys in the next video. TTFN. Bye. I love you. You're awesome.